have five friends, and these five friends are my best friends. I love them and I respect them. When I first started, after one month, I took the decision to invite one of these five friends that I have. His name was Marinos. And I asked him to watch the presentation. He watched the presentation and he was very positive. He told me, call me tomorrow morning, I'm going to give you my credit card and we start together. I was very happy. I had my best friend with me. Perfect. The next morning I called him and he told me, you know something? I don't believe that this is working. I check it out. It's a pyramid. You are an idiot and you don't have to do this. You are going to steal your money. And I told him, okay, this is your opinion. If you don't want to do this, no problem. Still, you are going to be my friend, but I'm going to do it. And he told me, okay. But the same day, it was August, and the same day, we are planning to go to a beach, have fun. And with us, we are going to be the other four friends that we have. So, I had in my mind that Marinos must not speak to my other friends before me. Because I didn't tell them anything. So, when we went to the beach, immediately Marinos started talking. And he said to my friends that, you know, Stavros is very idiot, he believes that he could make money from a pyramid, that he got his money, blah, 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 blah. Back in that days, I wasn't 100% sure about world ventures, because it was my first days. And I wasn't 100% sure if I was going to do this. But you know what Marinos did to me? He increased my belief level. Because at the time that he was pointing at me, and he was telling you are an idiot and you believe you are going to get money from this, I get very upset. And then he started laughing. And all my friends started laughing with me. And they were pointing at me, hey, you are going to make money. And I told them, look, I don't know what you are saying, but with this company, I'm going to make more than $10,000 per month in the next year. And then they laugh louder, 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 they are pointing at me. You are going to make $10,000, you are an idiot. And they laugh louder. And I had two options. First option was to stand up and beat him up. Yeah. Kick him in the ass. Oh, yeah. This was the first option. And the second option, was to prove him that I am right. Now, back in that days, I used to live in a small apartment <laughs> in Limassol, just one room. It was me, Katerina, in just one room. Our apartment was just one room. And Marinos knew me that I used to live in this apartment. Last year, I get married. And I called Marinos to invite him to my house to give him the wedding invitation to come to my wedding and two three months before we got into the dream house yeah. so marinos i expected him to come, to come and marinos came to my house and <laughs> as he was coming through the stairs he was like what happened here <laughs> like this and then he saw the swimming pool and then he saw the gym, the five bedrooms, the garden, and everything. And he said, what happened? And I told him, you remember that company that you told me? The house is fully getting paid from this company. Let me tell you something. I have to tell you something. Tell me, I'm sorry, and you had right. You had right back in that days. Mm -hmm. I had to believe you. And you know what I told him? I told him that, yes, but you helped me to do this. So thank you. Woo! And I, told him, I have a question right now for Marinos is who? is laughing now, yeah. and who is crazy now. Yeah. And some of your friends are going to kill you. Some of you are going to let other people, other people tell you that you cannot do it. But some of you are going to let other people push you 
by 10 people that you cannot do it. So every time that you're telling me that I cannot do it, is one more reason to do it. Every time that you're telling me I cannot do it, is one more reason to do it. So that's about drink stealers.